Now, as challenges rise in the Indian Ocean, the Indian Navy is expanding its might and deterrence capabilities to counter possible enemy attacks aiming the country. In a bid to further boost its military prowess, Indian Navy is all set to commission its one of the most powerful warships, INS Vishakhapatnam. Union Defence Minister Rajnath Singh and top naval commanders will attend the induction ceremony at the Naval Dockyard in Mumbai. This will be the first ship of uh, Project 15B, which has been developed to bring in a series of guided missile destroyers. The commissioning aims to reaffirm India's presence amongst an elite group of nations with the capability to design and build advanced warships. Vishakhapatnam has been constructed using indigenous steel and is amongst the largest destroyers constructed in India. It is equipped with an array of weapons and sensors, including supersonic surface-to-surface -surface and surface-to-air missiles, medium and short-range guns, and anti-submarine rockets. Now, along with INS Vishakhapatnam, Indian Navy will also induct its fourth submarine of the Kalvari class, Submarine Vea, and the commission will take place on the 28th of November. As per the official release, the commissioning of Vishakhapatnam and Vela are major milestones showcasing India's indigenous capacity to build complex combat platforms. Now, Vion's principal diplomatic correspondent, Sidhan Sibyl, brings you this report from the deck of one of the most powerful ships of the Indian Navy. Take a look. Behind me is Vishakhapatnam that will become INS Vishakhapatnam on 21st of this month with its commissioning. One of the biggest USP of the warship is that approximately 75% of it is locally manufactured. This is a big boost to Atma Nirbhar Bharat project. This is, of course, equipped with state-of-the-art uh, uh, systems, uh, radar, surface-to-surface -surface missile, surface-to-air missile, uh, but it's induction coming at a time when we have seen increased geopolitical changes in the Indian Ocean region. Vishaka Patnam. A P-15B stealth-guided missile destroyer will be commissioned into the Indian Navy in the presence of Indian Defence Minister Rajnath Singh on the 21st of November. The event marks the formal induction into the Navy of the first of the four Vishakhapatnam class destroyers. Indigenously designed by the Indian Navy's in-house organisation, the Directorate of Naval Design, and constructed by Mazagon Dock Limited, Mumbai. This majestic ship measures 163 meters in length, 17 meters in breadth, with a displacement of 7,400 tons. The ship is propelled by four powerful gas turbines in a combined gas and gas configuration, capable of achieving speeds of excess of 30 knots. Vishakhapatnam is equipped with state-of-the-art weapon system surface-to-surface -surface, uh, missile, surface-to-air missile, it has a state-of-the-art radar system and also it is equipped to fight under conditions such as biological or nuclear, in fact chemical warfare as well. The ship also has the capability of embarking two integrated helicopters to further extend her reach. The ship boasts of a very high level of automation with sophisticated digital network combat management systems, and integrated platform management system. The commissioning of the Vishakhapatnam is just the beginning. Within days, the Indian Navy will have another powerful addition to its arsenal. On November 25th, Indian Navy will induct the INS Vela, India's fourth Scorpion-class submarine. This French-designed Calavary-class submarine has been constructed by Mazagon Docks and Shipbuilders Limited in France's naval group. The submarine has been named after its old namesake, INS Vela, a Russian-origin Foxtrot-class submarine that had served the nation from 1973 to 2009, completing 37 years of service. The induction of uh, locally made uh, warship Vishakhapatnam and submarine Vela is a big boost to the Indian Navy's firepower. The development comes at a time when we have seen increased geopolitical changes in the Indian Ocean region, especially with increased Chinese presence. The Indian Navy plans to increase the number of ships it has from currently 130 to approximately 170 by the year 2027. With video journalist Kiran Sidhan Sibbal for Vion in Mumbai.
Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.